Hi everyone, it's me, Veronica again. Um, I am recording this video uh, to share a special story with you actually to um, hopefully inspire you to take action and move towards your health. Uh, my last video I explained to you a little bit about what my why was. Well, over the last month a lot has changed and so has my why actually. Um, you're watching this video because it either came up in your newsfeed or I personally tagged you. So please, if you have time, listen and watch the whole video because it's packed full. Um, hopefully it will inspire you to take action. Um, a brief little summary of what's been going on over the last month. It actually seems longer now that I think about it. I've been having a lot of physical symptoms um, and that were manifesting as dizziness. Um, shortness of breath, at times confusion, and the list goes on. Well, as a busy mom, busy wife, nurse, and health coach, I just dismissed those physical symptoms that were manifesting and was telling myself that I was stressed or exhausted and um, just kind of pushed forward. Well, after a long vacation, road trip, and coming home, everything kind of climaxed for me and I decided that I couldn't handle it anymore and I went to the doctor and after extensive blood work and testing um, I had to have my heart monitored and I did a 24 um, evaluation 24 hour excuse me evaluation of my heart and found out that I am having some cardiac issues nothing that I have control over not even really sure what is exactly going on except for that I have been feeling horrible um, so that has motivated me to come on and share with you and hopefully motivate you to take action with your health like I was saying earlier. You know, as a health coach, I've been working really hard at helping other people get healthy and changing their lives, helping people get off blood pressure medication, diabetes medication, preventing diabetes, feeling better, working on their confidence, and in the process, I've I've done that for myself as well. I have found health and feel good about where I am in that process and um, life just kind of threw me a curveball and yesterday was a really hard day. I gave myself yesterday to soak in this information and this life-changing event. As a mom I realized that my priority is my son, my husband, my family, my friends, everybody who's important to me, you all have impacted my life in a special way. And um, I felt that it was really important that I came on here and just shared this story with you, just allowing myself to be vulnerable and sharing with you what is a scary situation. I don't know what next week holds for me. I don't know what exactly is going on with my heart yet. Um, I pray that everything is going to be fine, and I trust in God that he'll take care of me. And I feel like it's important that I continue my work as a health coach and hopefully inspiring you to take action and work towards a healthier you. You never know when life is going to throw you that curveball. You never know when, um, you never know what tomorrow holds. So take action. Don't live in fear. Move forward and um, take control of your life because you can. And it's important that you do. There's people that love you and there's people that care about you. So. These tears are not because of sadness. They are because I feel passionate and I want for you to be the best you possible. So um, even though I am continuing on with this journey, this, this season in my life, um, I'm going to press forward and I'm going to figure out what's going on with my heart and I'm going to do everything that I can to better myself and I still want to walk with you and I still want to hold your hand because helping you helps me. So if you're ready to make a change in your life towards health, call me, message me, contact me, share this story with anybody that you love that is wanting to get healthy so that they're not in a situation like like this, potentially having cardiac problems because they didn't take action. Not that that's what's going on with me, but I want to continue to press forward and find out what is going on and hopefully um, hopefully this story inspires you or someone that you love so yes thank you for listening and um, we'll talk
talk soon.